Well, over the next few Saturdays, I thought I'd do some videos on what it means to follow Christ. And so today, uh, let's just start with this. Uh, what is it to be a Christian? Uh, last week, we had some good weather. Uh, it's the school holidays, and so lots of people have made their way down to the beach. Uh, people no longer have to stay local. Uh, at this time of year, the water is very cold. And uh, it's usually about this time of year that an advert sometimes comes on the telly from the RNLI, uh, the lifeboat people. And uh, the advert warns you about what it's like to fall into cold water unexpectedly. Uh, when you fall into cold water unexpectedly, you have the instinct to swim hard, uh, to kick hard with your legs, to put all your energy into swinging your arms around, uh, to put all your energy into fighting the cold water. But the advert warns, when you try to fight cold water, you'll lose, because cold water shock makes you gasp uncontrollably and breathe in water, and uh, that will cause you to drown. And so uh, the thing to do instead is uh, stop splashing around, just lean back and float, a float until that cold water shock has passed and then you'll be able to control your breathing and have a far better chance of staying alive. At the end of the advert some words appear on the screen. These words appear in capital letters, fight your instinct. What is it? to be a Christian. Uh, Jesus said this, he said, come to me and I will give you rest. Uh, the first thing we need to realise is our danger. Uh, we are like people who've been thrown into cold water, but the danger we're in is the danger of our sin. Uh, our sin is the wrong that we do. Our sin is our disobedience to God. Uh, it means we are not right with God. Uh, but just like the instinct of someone who's been plunged into cold water is to try hard and uh, to put energy into trying to swim, so too our instinct, when we realise we're not right with God, is to try and make ourselves right with God. Uh, we try to prove ourselves to him. But the Christian is someone who has come to understand that they, in themselves, can never make themselves right with God. Uh, their only hope is to rest in Christ. Uh, just like the best hope of the person who is plunged into cold water is to stop kicking uh, and instead uh, just lean back and float, uh, so too the Christian is someone who has rejected that instinct uh, to try and prove themselves to God and instead has come to rest in Jesus Christ and what he has done. What has he done? He has lived a perfect life of obedience to God and he did it for his people, for all who go to him. God considers that perfect life of obedience as yours, if you go to Jesus. Uh, what else has Jesus done? He has died on the cross. There on the cross, he took upon himself the punishment for sin, uh, for the sin um, of his people. He took a, upon himself the punishment that was due to his people. If you go to Jesus, it means the punishment you deserve for your sin was taken by him when he died on the cross. And so today, uh, are you resting in Jesus?